Blueberries, kale, salmon, you've probably heard about the nutritional benefits of these everyday ingredients that are commonly labeled as superfoods. But there are some lesser known powerhouse foods and Healthy Julie is here with us this morning. Tell us what those are and how we can work those into our diet. Good morning. Yes, good morning. So what makes a food super? Well, simply put, it's a massive amount of nutrients in a small little package. Okay, so, so we've all heard of the kale and different things we're supposed to be working in, but these are three that I was not very aware of. We're starting out with this bee pollen. Bee pollen, this actually has um, every nutrient that your body needs in order to survive. It's, a, it's again, a massive amount of nutrients, and so it also has every um, amino acid that, you, that your body needs. So you can add this to smoothies or brownies, you can add it to anything. It has a really light floral flavor, and um, also, if you get local bee pollen, then it really helps with allergies as well. Oh, you're kidding. Yeah, okay, and so, then you've made some little treats here. Yep. So really, I just sprinkled it on these little um, puff, millet puff snacks that I've made. And uh, it just adds another boost of nutrition. Woo. Like, you can have your dessert and your healthy food at the same time. <laughs> That's good. Right? Isn't mm -hmm. that nice? So I made this with sunflower butter and a little uh, maple syrup and some hemp seeds and uh, millet puffs. Great, okay. Yes. Goji berries. Goji berries, I love these. I have them every day. I just snack them on, on them just like this. They're tangy, but they're also full of antioxidants, which helps um, combat everyday toxins. So what I like to do, again, you can sprinkle them on anything, but I love to put them in tea. And so here I have a hibiscus tea, and I really just, just um, put these in here. They plump up within like two minutes and you have this nice little um, extra boost of nutrition in your morning tea or afternoon tea. Well, that sounds easy enough. Yes. Okay, so tell me about this mesquite powder. Mesquite powder, it's made from a bean pod from the mesquite tree in South America, and it's actually a very low glycemic sweetener. So it's kind of like a powdery oh. sweetener, and gl low glycemic means that it um, helps regulate your blood sugar more easily. So. So um, right here, we're adding this into... Yeah, you can just add it into your almond butter. You can add it to your smoothies. You can add it to your oatmeal. Again, you can all of these you can add to pretty much anything. And I like to put them on my little crackers, in my afternoon crackers, with a little berry and some fresh mint. That mint is from my garden. It's so fresh and wonderful. And it's just a really great way to add pop into your diet and a little bit of extra nutrition. Mesquite powder is also full of mm. protein. Oh, so it's an excellent afternoon protein snack. Bang for the buck there. Okay, yes. so you can check out all of these ingredients and ways you can work them into your diet if you check out the website. Thanks for coming in Thank with you. all these healthy snacks. Yeah. Back to you, Tom. It's almost 8 o'clock. The latest on the